Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Super Mario World. We're right here at Donuts Go Donut Ghost House, right where we left off. However, I it seemed to be a little unacceptable. Wait, where am I going? I need cape, and I need it now. Come to me, Cape. What? What? No! Come back here! Okay, it, it's fine. He'll come back. Because I didn't kill him. There he is. Okay, don't kill him. Uh, and he'll come back a second time. Uh, I want two capes. This time, I don't care if I kill him. But I'll spare him. Because I am merciful. But anyway... <laughs> over to donut ghost house this ghost house has two exits the secret exit is going to take us to a top secret area and the regular exit will take us to donut planes 3 it's actually a really cool effect um donut planes 3 is over to our right and it'll create a bridge it's kind of cool i'll just, just whatever i actually want to do the secret first and i'll and you'll understand why in a second Okay, the first thing we're gonna do is go over here, run all the way back, fly up here, run all the way here. It's one of the secretiest secrets. Every one of these has a one-up, and we're just gonna... I think one of them despawned because there are too many sprites on the screen at the same time. That makes me sad. <laughs> I despawned one of my own one-ups. Whoa, swing and miss on that one. So that's disappointing. But anyway, <laughs> top secret area. One of the coolest secrets in the entire game, I think. Why is this place so cool? A few reasons. Number one, free, two free feathers on this side two free fire flowers so if you want one of each or if you're just a fan of one or the other but also Yoshi and guess what you leave you go back in one up and you can just get one ups this way as many one ups as you want <laughs> anyway let's do this level again uh, and this time beat it the normal way uh, what does this say, actually? Oh, this is a ghost house. Can you find the exit? <laughs> Don't get lost. I won't. I'm actually... I hate this particular uh, uh, ghost house because those ghosts that swoop down. Not my favorite. Uh, I wonder if I can fly up. <clears throat> fly. Okay, let's try it. Can I fly? I could. I could. Hey! Hey! Hey, you leave me alone. Hey, you stop that. Hey. Hey. Nope. Uh, whatever. It's easier if you just... You, know, you come in here. Freaking hit the vine. Wait. This is supposed to be a vine. Why isn't it a vine? No, no, no. Okay, I think you come in here a second time. Now it's a vine. Okay. You hit the vine. You go up. Leave me alone, ghosts. Regular exit. You can fly up here. I'm sure there's a way to fly up here. You could. I just know it. Okay, but this is the real exit. Get that tape. Oh, yeah. I tell you. Anyway. <laughs> Good grief. Let's stand right here. Hopefully get all flowers. I messed up. Not too bad, though. Got three mushrooms for a three up. Okay, this next level is Donut Plains of four. You see how cool that is? Creates a little river and then a bridge. I love that. Uh, Donut Plains, f I'm sorry, Donut Plains three. Um, I'm gonna scoot the screen forward because this is a treacherous level. Uh, lots of ways to fall, lots of ways to die. 
and the introduction of one of our favorite enemies. Um, I'm not gonna eat that. I'm not gonna eat this blue turtle. Wow. Did not expect that. You can fly their secret. Their secrets up top. Uh, if you're if you're curious, I believe actually, if I'm not mistaken, and I could be. I believe there is a. Uh, oh, where did you come from? I was too busy. I was. I was taught. Oh my god. I believe there is a. Yeah. Not worth it because Yoshi died, but. I didn't even see that. I don't even know what the heck. Whatever, man. You can fly pretty much this level. Ugh. That is so upsetting. Just for that, I'm going to kill, like, every Koopa I see. What is this? Uh, you can slide the screen left to right. I already know that. I, I knew that already. Like this. All right. We're going to stand here. You can actually control how the enemies spawn by doing this. No! No. Bye. Wow. Ugh. Well... I cannot believe I died. Oh, this was a mistake. Uh, let's let's get out. Right, you're supposed to get the fire. I, I, wow, this is turning into uh, not good. Can't believe I died. I was hoping to at least make it to the vanilla dome before dying. This is uh, this is the worst. This is the absolute worst. Okay. All right, let's focus. Stop trying to explain things and just do the thing. Right, like I said, this is a treacherous level. Uh, falling will lead to your death. Yeah. See, that one, I, I, I ate it and I spit it out at the other guy. And I thought that that would, you know, kill it. But not so. Uh, I'm not going to go back for the coin. I just don't care that much. This part's not so bad anyway. Okay, with Yoshi. With Yoshi. This should be easier. No, you got... See, that was the problem last time too. That I missed. There we go. Okay. You want to hit this again. And here you have the fuzzies. I'm just going to duck. Here's another coin. And the mid-tape... And then the fuzzies, man. The fuzzies love their tracks. I don't know why, but they do. Don't question it. All right. <laughs> We're going to stay on this track. You can go in the one below, but this one has the other dragon coins and also a secret. And we want secrets. It's not really a secret. It's in plain sight. Yes. Give me all the lives. Wow, that one, that one wasn't good. That was a bad one. Yeah, not bad. Got a few one-ups. Oh, I forgot about that, Buzzy. This is, this might, like what I'm saying is, this might be the one that you want the, uh, to, put, to push the screen right so you can see what's coming so that you're not making blind jumps like that. Not a big deal, not a big deal, not a big deal. All right, we are at Donut Plans 4. This is a pretty tricky level. We're going to want... We're going to want... Um, Kate Mario. Definitely, we'll, we'll definitely want Kate Mario for the duration of this level, so hopefully we can keep it. There are a couple of secrets, actually. Um... Though the yellow, oof, if 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 a Koopa comes in to a yellow um, shell like that, they turn into these like monster, crazy uh, Koopas that cannot be uh, controlled. Now, if I go ahead and eat this guy, I want to say this. I don't want to waste time. If I go ahead and eat this guy, I can fly for a short period of time. And 
I might want to do this so that I can avoid uh, an enemy that's coming up. I do want to, that that guy. I don't want him. Ooh, I don't want that guy. Uh, so I wanted to avoid that. I believe there. No. No, no, no. Goodness. <laughs> Okay, back up to the secret zone. Two deaths in one episode. So this time we'll do the smart thing, get the mushroom, and then I'll go ahead and get that one. Then we want to get the 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 the, the, the thingies so that they don't turn into mushrooms. Right. Okay. Yeah, man, that's not that's not cool. <laughs> It is a little embarrassing, not gonna lie. Okay, don't want him to turn into that um, crazy, crazy. If you eat the, the glowing shell like that though, uh, what you do get is pretty cool. Uh, you can fly and shoot fire. Um, and stomp, when you land you stomp and you kill every enemy in the screen, pretty cool. All right, what you want to do here, this is, this is, how do I explain this? This block is, if you walk around it in a certain order, at the bottom first, this side, and then, oh, I was supposed to, if you, why am I not doing it? Do I have to be off Yoshi? Okay, what you're supposed to do, one, two, Three, four. Why isn't it not happening? There it is. If you touch, if you, there's a certain order that you walk around this block, and you can spawn one ups and stuff like that. There are a couple of instances like this. Um, I might try to show them off uh, if I can. Aha! Perfect landing. That's exactly what I was looking for. I am so good at this game. <laughs> anyway. Get ourselves a one up here. Uh, Paragoombas. <sighs> okay, anyway. Paragoombas. Wait till they, uh, let's see. So this is going to go mushroom, flower. And I want to kill this guy. There we go. So we can use this to come up here and then run past this part as fast as we can. All right, not bad. Not bad. Not bad. There's also I, I didn't I missed this or in the part where the um, the paratroopa goombas are coming down. There's also a three up moon if you fly, but I I missed it. I'm not gonna go back for it. It's not worth it. I have 31 lives. Why do I need? Why do I need this many um, one ups anyway? Now, Morton's Castle has a secret right at the beginning. I'm going to give it a couple of tries and, and try to get it. It's a tricky one. So these are thwimps. Uh, they're thwomp, but they're wimps, you see. So, I guess. Now, if we fly all the way to the right... This is so treacherous, yeah? Where can I stand where I won't get hit? Right here. I'm going to try to make this run. Ah, oh, perfect. This will actually let you skip part of the level while at the same time bringing you to a bonus stage. I think I find the fact that it lets you skip part of the stage a little bit more useful than the one-ups because, I, I mean, at this point we're at 33. Do we really need 33 lives? We don't. So anyway, this is a part of the castle that is going to have uh, moving platforms like this. You can get squished and you will die. If you get squished, you die. It's, I'm sure, a horrible way to go. I believe that has a flower, not a flower, a feather. Eek. Okay. 
I risked that for no reason. I shouldn't have. There's no reason to rush through that part. None. Uh, little... Little... Uh, not Stalfos. Wow. Whatever those things are called. Definitely not a Stalfos. Uh, dry bones. <laughs> Good grief. Uh, you can go in there for some coins. I'm not going to bother. Uh, you can also hit this. I believe it's this one. It has a vine. And you can go up that small uh, opening. And it is a little safer. Because uh, you won't get squished. Uh, I, I don't know what's down there. I don't remember if there's like a one-up, like a hidden one-up or something like that. Uh, there might. There might be. Uh, like a like an invisible block uh, but I don't really see that there's a point at all come on now there we go if you got the green switch palace you will see that there is a helpful green block right there it just makes it a little easier. And another feather if you're in the need. And then Morton is not particularly tough. So if you hit him like this, he will climb up the wall. He's got sticky shoes or something. He'll climb on the ceiling and he'll land where you are. And if he lands on the floor and you're on the floor, you get stunned because of the his fatness. So you want to jump right before he does and just jump on his head three times. And that's it. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. I find Morton, even though he's the second bad guy, the second boss, much easier than Iggy. Morton Koopa Jr. of Castle Number 2 is now just a memory. The next area is the underground vanilla dome. What traps await Mario in this new world? What will become of Princess Toad's tool? Indeed. What indeed will become of Princess Toad's tool? We head into Vanilla Dome. Continue and save. Vanilla Dome is a cool world. Everything is obviously caves and underwater and what have you. Uh, I do want to... Tried. Uh, I'm gonna do. Uh, I'm gonna do vanilla dome one. Vanilla, obviously dome. Vanilla. <sighs> English is hard. Vanilla dome one, obviously has two exits. It's not a particularly tough level. I'm only gonna do the first exit uh, for now. Well, I did not mean to do that. But that was kind of cool. Supers don't swoop me. Um, I'm not going to, I'm not going to do this right now. Why, 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 is there something up here? Yeah, I don't remember. I don't think there is. Uh, there's a, I do want to see if I can get all the dragon coins this time. Maybe. Uh, this is bad. Okay. No, no. Whew. That's why I said this is bad. I was like, how am I going to get past this? Okay. I'm just going to fly over this. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. I'm not going to fly over anything. Don't... I said don't suit me. <laughs> okay. I don't want that. Go away. All right. Now, here will be some ladders later on. Not ladders. Um, blocks later on you can climb. I believe that takes you to a secret exit, if I recall correctly. No matter, though. We're not interested yet. We're going to the normal exit first. You definitely want this because... I don't know how possible it is to finish that part without the star. I'm sure it's possible, but just very difficult. All right. Midway tape. Here we go. I forget that you don't spit these guys out. You eat them and that's it. Some spinies, I believe. Yeah, Yoshi can eat them. The dragon coin is up there. Uh, you kind of have to be little Mario to get it. Um, 
I don't care that much. I certainly don't care enough to be little Mario. I don't want that. I don't want that. Whatever. Nothing here. Nothing. Nothing. Oh. Excuse me. Come on, Yoshi. You can do it. Okay. Uh, more secrets here. Okay, that's not going to work. Uh-oh. I forgot. You swallow those again. I, I forgot once more. You, you don't eat those guys. Uh, don't care. Let's fly. No! Not what I meant. <laughs> None of that went according to plan. <laughs> None of that went according to plan. That's okay. In fact, I don't actually think we can even get the secret exit until we get the red switch palace. I'm sure there's a way to get the secret exit on that one without the switches. Uh, but I don't know how. So for now, we're not going to get it. And we're just going to go ahead and get this. And you know, while we're here, we might as well get an, a one-up. Don't need it, but we might as well. And in the next episode, we're going to continue on with Vanilla Dome. I'm going to do Vanilla Dome 2. Uh, the Vanilla uh, vanilla Ghost House. And then the Switch Palace. And then eventually we'll head over on the opposite side of Vanilla Dome 1 and do all the Vanilla Secrets. So, thank you for joining me for this episode of Super Mario World. And I will see you next time where we are not going to die a single time. Until then.